to make the mat safe, you start off with a block. So essentially all I did was start off with a big rectangular block. And then I sculpted the actual safe's outer hole out. Uh, first did the outer rim. I actually added in a little bit of a dip in the center section, just like in the actual match safe. After that, I was able to overlay an image of the actual part on top of this in the software. And I traced out all of the main features. And by tracing out different, different sections, I was able to extrude them or pull them out from the main block in different lengths. So it gives it a nice three-dimensional effect. So you can see the, the snake is actually winding around inside and outside the safe. And then I added a bunch of scales to it. Uh, scales really added a lot of texture. And finally, I did a cut right along here. So at, up until recently, it was one solid piece. I did a cut along it and then pulled them apart a little bit and added in the hinge. And uh, in the end, of, we had to actually have an insert to pin them together. Uh, but otherwise, this is printed as two different pieces that can be stuck together and that allows the flexibility to actually pull apart. I also hollowed it out and I had small inserts to make it really stable, that way it doesn't flex in. 